Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, we of course are going to have today a Google Chrome update that will have more news about when it is released later in the day. But for now I wanted to tr talk about uh, Edge on the Canary version. So of course there are insider builds of Microsoft Edge that can be tested and that's why I have a developer Edge, a Canary Edge and of course the standard user edge that everybody the stable version as we call it now one of the things that uh, both google and microsoft have mentioned and even firefox is that we're getting to a point where the browsers will reach version 100 and there's a little bit of some you know, worry that websites some websites might be broken um canary was updated this week to version 100 and uh, so you see it here at 100.0.1179. So this is the, the, the most advanced version of Google, of uh, Microsoft Edge, sorry, with all the latest, ver the latest features that will eventually make it. Um, this is the equivalent to the Dev Channel Insiders for Windows 11, which means that it could be, you know, have problems, be broken, have instabilities, it all depends. So what I did is go through um, many websites. I went through several dozen websites of every kind, did some searches, went through different places to see if you know anything special was happening, if anything was broken uh, in searches and so on, what could be you know happening. And what I noticed is that there isn't anything that I've done yet that has shown me that the browser um, has broken any websites. So the websites seem to work well. Things seem to be okay. Um, I have had no problems, honestly, with anything with that. So that, I think, is good news because it means that uh, things are probably going to be okay for most people when we do reach version 100. Now, there is a mitigation feature because what's happening with the Microsoft Edge browser and with every browser, including Chrome, they did say that for the known websites that are not going to work well, they already have a little string of characters within the browser that's going to tell broken websites, well, I'm not, ver I'm a version 99, so that it, they continue working. So that also will mitigate the uh, broken websites. But uh, overall, I haven't seen any problems yet. And of course, if I do, I'll talk about it. But uh, I think this is good news to see that uh, the first browser that I'm testing that is at version 100 is, um, of course, um, working well. So um, for those that don't know what the um, Microsoft Edge uh, Insider program is all about, is you can, of course, test the new features of Edge before everybody else. Uh, what's nice about the Edge Insider program is that it doesn't break anything else, so you can actually download the Canary or Dev or Beta Channel version and just test it out without changing anything. It won't change anything, even if you use Google Chrome. It won't touch anything there, so you can actually test it and um, you know still be okay with the rest of your browsing uh, if you want to do so. I uh, test all of them because I like to test new things in advance. The most advanced version is the Canary version, followed by the dev version, and the beta version is what is close to be released in the uh, standard version. So version 100 is reached on Edge Canary. Of course, if you look on your standard um, or stable version Edge, we're not there yet. Stable version Edge just reached the uh, version 98 and uh, this is what we have right now as the latest version so it's going to take still uh, a few quite a few weeks before we reach 100 but it's going to arrive it's going to be there at some point and chrome today is going to be at 99 if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching our videos